Hello and welcome to the Etihad Stadium. I'm Derek Ray and delighted to have Stuart Robson sharing commentary duties with me. And we'll kick off just moments away. We really should be in for a magnificent occasion. It is Manchester City and they face Al Nasser. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. And so they start at 11 for Manchester City. Ederson begins in goal. Kevin De Bruyne plays with Rodri in central midfield. And the main threat in attack today should be Erling Haaland. And introducing the visitors lineup today. Well, in this shape, if their wide players stay high up the pitch and get enough of the ball, it's a very attacking lineup. But if they drop too deep, they will then leave the centre forward isolated, and it could be difficult for them. And the game begins. Yahya. Ronaldo. Anderson Tavisca. Great opportunity. Oh, tremendous work from the keeper to avert the danger. A very timely interception. Jack Grealish. Now a potentially dangerous position for City. Perfect challenge. Well, Kevin De Bruyne, one of the complete midfield players in the modern game. Stuart, what do you expect we'll see from him this time around? Well, Derek, we know he loves linking up with other players, but it's when he's in and around the penalty area, that's when he's at his most dangerous, when he plays little one-tubes around his marker and then plays the next forward pass into a runner. He could be the key to unlocking this defence. Gundogan on to Grealish Rodri moving the ball effectively De Bruyne Erling Haaland Gundogan well that's really strong play to keep hold of the ball Al Ghanam. Sultan Al Ghanam. And he's won the ball. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Anderson Tavisca. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Stones on to Mares. Kevin De Bruyne Rodri it's with Gundogan every pass hitting its target but then the one that goes astray Anderson Taliska Ronaldo and City recovering possession well He continues his run. Anderson Tavisca. Can he put them in front? The importance of that tackle cannot be overstated. De Bruyne. Oh, 
Ronaldo. Fine work from City to win the ball back. A meaty but fair challenge, and it will be a throw in. It's a promising City move. Mares. Well, it looks so promising, but a goal kicked the outcome. Getting forward. And it's with Luis Gustavo here. And a goal from Cristiano Ronaldo. That will be such a boost for them. Well, here it is again. And you have to say the 1-2 completely opens up the defensive structure. And his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. So City gets the match restarted. Can they come up with an equaliser having conceded? Nicely timed tackle. Abdul Rahman Harib. Here's Ronaldo. Anderson Tanisca. Textbook defending inside the box. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. Oh, he wasn't ruthless enough in front of goal. Keeper has it now. Well, there you have it. City just haven't been good enough in the attack in third. Unless that improves, they'll get nothing from this game. Quite simply, they just need to get on the ball more than they have been. A goal! That's two for him today. They simply can't stop him. No wonder he's celebrating. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a really nice ball to put him through. The vision to set up the chance is outstanding, and then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal. So the ball rolling again. 2-0 the score. The referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time. Ake. And that is going to be all for the first 45 then here at the Etihad Stadium. Well, we're focusing on Cristiano Ronaldo for a reason, Stuart. Fair to say, he's been at his brilliant best. Well, the keeper will be sick at the sight of him. He's been shooting from everywhere and he's taking his goals really well. And so the match is underway. And it's with Luis Gustavo here. And a goal from Cristiano Ronaldo. That will be such a boost for them. Back in business and no sugarcoating it. There was a big gulf between them in the first half. Will we see a response from City in the second? Cristiano Ronaldo. Ayman Yahya. Ronaldo. 
And here's Luis Gustavo. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. Breaking at pace. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. Good tackle. It'll be a throw. Ake. Gunduan. On to Holland. De Bruyne. Well, this would help them get back into the game. Must score. And it goes to reduce the deficit. Still very much alive and kicking. Well, here it is again, and the defending simply isn't good enough. They have to react quicker, deal with the danger, and show more urgency. None of which they did, and that's the result. Well, the action underway again. Can City go hunting for an equaliser now? Cristiano Ronaldo trying to really get at the opposition here Anderson Talisca really important piece of last ditch defending Kevin De Bruyne really good attacking play and a chance to level it and thwarted there, following the cross. Now can they counter clinically? And City with the ball again. Riyad Mahrez. Riyad Mahrez. De Bruyne now. And he's in. We'll just take another look at this because the one two to get behind the defense is superbly worked and there's certainly no doubt about the finish he really hits it with power and accuracy nothing the keeper can do about that not many sides would have the mental strength to bounce back from adversity like this team Luis Gustavo Cristiano Ronaldo moving the ball effectively looking for the right moment can they trouble the opposition this time well nothing comes of it it looked promising Jack Grealish twenty minutes remaining Ake. De Bruyne now. Holland. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Mares! Oh, it's astonishing! One of the greatest comebacks you're ever likely to see. And now the question is, can they see this out? Well, here's the replay, and he's got to clear his lines there. He doesn't do that. He has his pocket picked and he's been rightly punished. Poor defending. <laughs> what a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? <laughs> Ronaldo. And take it away. De Bruyne. Grealish. Timely intervention. Abdul Rahman Harib. Well, the counter chance looks very real. 
Can they take advantage of the situation? Ronaldo. A corner kick, and who knows, this might represent their last chance to grab an equaliser. A change in the offing for City. To be replaced by number two, Callum Walker. So the corner played into the box. Not really the ideal clearance. Luis Gustavo. The end product just wasn't there. Kevin De Bruyne. Five minutes remaining, and one thing is certain, no one is leaving because it's still close. Luis Gustavo. They get forward, but time... Well, it's the late show, and they are level again. Just look at this again. The combination play in the top third of the field was so precise. And Ronaldo's shot is then hit with such power. He's a top-class player when he gets into those areas. Neither side shy about shooting in this match. Rodri, Gundogan, and with that, the attack fizzles out. What about the stoppage time situation? Two minutes the word. Gundogan, and Sissi on the front foot near the end of this contest. Still level here. De Bruyne, Holland. With so little time left, surely that will be the winner. Amazing scenes here. Well, it's great awareness of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure with the finish. That's a clever goal. And that is going to be that. Well, a tale of woe in terms of the scoreline as far as the visitors are concerned here. Well, Derek, not quite good enough today. Yes, they only lost by one goal, but I never felt they were in control of the game. A frustrating day all round for the coach to think about for the next time.